Good morning, folks, and welcome back to the channel. So, it's like 8.30 a.m. April 5th, question mark. My watch is charging, so... Um, I just did my makeup. I only did, like, mascara and concealer, and my eyebrows are dyed, so... Um, I just woke up. I'm about to go clean my uncle's house and probably do shift for a while. I've got goals this week because it's spring break. Um, something I was going to talk a little bit about, which I'll do like, while I'm doing my hair, um, is I'm going to get May 28th uh, another tattoo. Um, for those of you that don't know, I have two tattoos. I have um, the outline of a heart like on my ribs right here, and then I have an elephant that's holding a flower on my thigh, and my mom has the same tattoo. It was like um, a together tattoo for my birthday. So I scheduled um, May 28th, because that was his first day appointment. Um, I scheduled that because I'm going to go in and get um, start my leg sleeve, which is like um, going to be roses like wrapped around my leg. And then it's going to be like a timeline um, down it of like memories and shit. And so um, I'm going to get that started. But that's obviously need to pay for it. So it's going to be like, it's $800 for a day session plus tip. So um, I was going to hopefully have like a thousand on me. I don't know how much I'm going to tip him yet because I mean, it sounds ridiculous to tip him $200. But at the same time, that's 20% A and B, like, I appreciate the artwork. You know what I mean? Wow, this did not <laughs> go as planned. Anyways, so um, my goal is to make all of that this week so that way i just have it done and taken care of i already have the money set aside for my teeth tomorrow and for the vet appointment friday so i'm doing okay um i've got like a list of like financial goals that i have and i want to accomplish them all by mid-august so that's what we're trying to do Mom! So anyways, um, I'm about to go put some shoes on and then go get my mop and my broom and put them in my car and then we're just going to get started. I'm hoping to be done with this by 11. I'm starting at 9. So it's only two hours. So that's the goal. I will update y'all in a few. <sighs> it is 1028 and I just got home been a little frustrating this morning but I don't even need to get into it we're leaving it in the morning where the heck is my kitten ow mittens greeted me at the door where is my kitten mittens where is she he I don't know anyways um I'm waiting for shift orders to come through but so far that hasn't happened um, I'm gonna eat something. I just put like my cleaning stuff away and if nothing comes through by the time I'm done, I'm gonna go organize for my mom at the salon. What? What? So anyways, I'm tired. I know. So, yes, that is the plan as of right now. I will update y'all when I know what's up. Um, for now, I'm going to go look for my kitten because she's so, she he is so small that I'm like, it, like, it can literally fit under everything. Like, my dresser and stuff and like, literally everywhere. So, I'm like, hmm, where did you fall asleep? Goodness, how did you get up here? How? Oh, you're so cute. Yeah, I know you know. So I did put that down there for this little one, but that works too. She's... You're so cute.
pretty sure he she is looking for a nipple right now. So I think I'm gonna go try and get the bottle. And hopefully it'll work. Yes, hopefully. Yes. You're purring so loud. Okay, folks, um, I am now at a Z grocery store. I'm about to take an order and we'll see if more pop up. Um, if not, I'm gonna go work for my mom and do some organizational stuff for her. So I'm trying to like shove shit in my purse right now. Um, it's 12.09 and the order is due between one and two. The goal is closer to one. Um, so we gonna go do that. Girl, tell me why I just talked for like two minutes and I wasn't even recording. Okay, so don't worry, I am paying attention to the road. I'm not like looking at the camera or anything like that. But um, I'm about, it's actually warm out for the first time in Michigan. My car says 81, but I do have a black car, so I'm sure like that's not accurate. Um, 72, yes, that sounds accurate, but it feels hot. So I literally have my air conditioning on. I just turned it down so you guys can hear me. But I'm about to stop home and get a water really quick because I'm thirsty. I just finished those two orders and they were so, like, the second lady was so sweet. She was like, um, it's not letting me rate and tip people, so I left the tip for you, um, on the door. She gave me, like, a $20 tip. That was so sweet. Like, I don't think people understand, like, how nice it is when people, like, tip as well because it really is kind of hard work. Like, you're in rush mode the whole fucking time. And on top of that, um... Like, most people just won't tip. Like, at all. And it's just really frustrating. What the hell is this guy doing? Anyways, so, um, that was very generous. I have two more orders already that I scheduled myself for, like, that I claimed. I don't know how many I'm gonna take, because, like, I do have goals this week, but I also don't want to, like, exhaust myself for my spring break, you know? So I'm trying to find a balance. I probably will only take those two orders, because that's four orders today, but we'll see how it goes, you know? Um, anyways, that was very stressful for a minute, because I didn't realize I claimed them both for one to two, so I was like, okay, so this one's gonna be, like, closer to two, and the other one is gonna be, like, early, which is great, because most people like it early, you know? Well, then I started stressing, because I was like, this second order, okay, so the first order was, so I live here, the first order was over here, and the second order was all the way back over here. So, just to, like, to put it in perspective, and, like, where I live is where the store's at. So anyways, um, it was a little stressful for a second, but got it under control. They were both on time, so that was fantastic. Um, I'm about to go do these other two orders, pick myself up water real quick, and I'm supposed to check about pools at Meyer, and I need to get a new bottle because that one, like, the way that he, she is chewing it, like, it kind of broke a little more. Like, I cut the tip off so that, like, more milk was coming out. Uh, not too much, but, like, I think that, I think you're supposed to cut it, and, um, then, like, chewing it, like, made it too short, so, yes, that is the update. You are so freaking cute, I can't, I just get to walk into this, oh my goodness. Hello, guys, I just got back, um, I did, I don't know how many, I don't remember when I filmed the last clip, but I did, like, four, or, four, four orders total-ish. There you are! Hi. I don't, like, it's so hard because you really can't tell on video or in pictures how small this cat is, but when I say tiny, I mean tiny. Um, anyways, so it was all good, dandy. I'm like $10 short of my today's goal, but 
it's not that serious. Well, actually, it's only five, but I spent only five bucks because, well, ten bucks, but we don't need to talk about it. Because I got myself some chips. Um, these look delicious, and I'm starving. Um, I got myself some salsa. I've never tried this kind. It was just kind of what I saw that, like, ooh, it's thick and chunky. Ooh. Got me some fat food, too. Got these Yo Crunch M&Ms. Um... Last time I accidentally got the strawberry ones. I don't think I did that this time. Ting. I wish we had our air conditioners in right now. Like, I'm hot. What? Tell them. Tell them. Tell them. I think this one was a little milk drunk after that. Um, also, I got a new bottle because um, that one, like, I cut off the tip. But um, he, she, like, bit it shorter. So, yikes. Anyways, that's all. I don't know if you guys can hear me or not, but I showered and now I'm panning. That's okay. whoa okay so i went to i went in or words i ate dinner and went to meyer with brooklyn um for something for her grandma then went and watched sunset and then went back to meyer because my mom wanted nyquil well we're looking a little bald right there anyways um and here we are basically i'm just laying in bed considering dyeing my hair again we'll see got my dentist appointment in the morning so let's go oh jk i'm going to bed pretty soon it's like 9 38 so i need to charge my stuff take my pills get ready for bed probably journal a little and it'll be tomorrow Good morning, guys. So, um, I'm about to go to my dentist appointment. It's 8.40, I gotta go, but I wanted to show you the OOT. So I got my little Vans on. These are American Eagle. This is Levi's. I'm so stupid. Um, I low-key could not find a shirt this morning, and I'm still not obsessed with this one because it looks like right here is fat, and it's not. So it's not giving me that, like, you know what I mean? But, and then I got the purse. Um, peeped a little tattoo, and we're about to go. I'm back. The whole side of my face is so numb. And, like, even my ear is numb. I'm not even playing. But I'm starving. I, I meant to eat before I went, and I totally forgot because I don't normally eat in the morning that early. And, oh, Jesus. I'm starving. It's really sad, though, because... I asked them, basically, I couldn't even put chapstick on. I was struggling, but I could tell my lips were drier than a mofo. But, I'm about to take some ibuprofen or something. My mom told me that it's probably going to hurt when this numbing goes away. But, it's really sad because I asked them, basically, like, what do you think causes this? Because I take really good care of my teeth. And, basically, she was like, honestly genetics probably because um you have really deep grooves so not necessarily that it's not enough or not words i'm struggling not necessarily that it's impossible for you to not get cavities but basically like it's very likely like almost inevitable for me to get cavities because of my genetics so it really sucks, but my face is even like kind of swollen. I don't know if you can see it or not. No. Anyways, I'm about to chill with the cat a little bit. Wait till this numbing wears off so that I can eat something without fucking shit up. I don't know. 
Update, I'm about to risk not getting gas. Probably a very bad idea, but it's okay. And go to Saturdays, and I hope you guys can hear me because I just realized I'm plugged into my aux, but about to go to Sally's and get some purple hair dye and dye my hair like lilac, so I'll see you there. Okay guys, it's been about 45 minutes to an hour. This looks so much prettier on camera. It's kind of like blue toned in person. It better not fucking turn out blue, I can tell you that much. But it's supposed to be more like a tint and it looks like an eye, so we'll see what happens. I don't know, I'm about to rinse it in a little. I'll show you guys what happens after that. Side note, my face is not numb anymore and it does hurt a little bit. We're gonna shower. Hello folks, so I'm going to talk to you for a second while I'm getting ready. Um, I've literally been doing the simplest makeup, so I'll probably be done getting ready before I'm even done talking. But, um, <clears throat> sorry, I just woke up. It, I don't even know what time it is. It's before 9, it's like 8.30 or something. And I didn't set an alarm or anything, but my body's just used to waking up early now, I guess. Um, anyways, so a couple things. Um, it's now Thursday morning. Um, I didn't continue filming that much yesterday because, um, I was not having a good day, so I didn't feel bad either because, um, I knew this was a weekly vlog, I didn't need this to be an hour long anyways, um, but basically, like, my tooth was hurting so bad, like, my whole mouth, like, my mouth was swollen down here, you couldn't really tell, like, if I took a picture or something, but I could feel it really bad. My mom said she could kind of tell in person. But yeah, it was hurting really bad. And then, oh. and then I tried to dye my hair and I was really disappointed at first because it literally, like I'm not even kidding you, looked blue. And I was so mad because I was like, what, I can't stay away from blue now? But now today it's looking a lot more purple. I put it in braids yesterday. And, um, and then like when I like woke up this morning I was like oh it's looking a lot more purple today it's still got like a tint of bluey I I think personally but I do like how vibrant it is um and I do wish it was a little more purpley but that's okay um it all worked out so um that's the update on that today um I'm going to do some shit um hopefully I don't know how it's gonna be because it's gonna start raining and I don't really want to do it in the rain but at the same time like money you know um and I also don't know if people will be ordering because it's raining you know what I mean um so we will see what happens with that other than that I do need to work for my mom a little bit um if I need to reschedule I might but Honestly, um, with the rain and stuff, I feel like I'm going to end up working for my mom and not doing shit at all. So, um, that's what's going on with that. I, yesterday, I'm starving right now because yesterday I literally, like, it was very hard for me to eat. I feel a lot better today, by the way. Like, it, I don't really have any pain like last night. And I know this is disgusting. I felt so disgusting, but I literally didn't even brush my teeth because... Like, it hurt so bad. I did not want to irritate it anymore. Like, I was afraid to floss this morning. Because, <laughs> like, for those of you that know me, I know that I've never had a filling. Um, I was thinking that I had one when I was little, but I talked to my mom about it because I didn't remember actually, like, getting it done. I just remember them saying I had a cavity and, um, and something with a needle. But then I realized that needle was probably when they pulled one of my baby molars because apparently it wasn't falling out fast enough, which was a load of bullshit because it still took it like two or three months after that to grow in. But anyways, so um, that's what happened with that. So I've never actually had a filling done, so I didn't know what to expect. And I think my mouth was just very like not okay with the foreign substance and on top of them was pretty bad. So I think when they put medicine in the one that was really bad so that I potentially shouldn't have to get an, a root canal in the future. Um, I think that like killing off the bacteria in my root, I'm, I'm thinking is what it was doing. I think it was like an antibiotic of sorts. Um, 
I think that is what was hurting so bad. So I'm hoping when I go next Wednesday for my other fillings, it won't be as bad. But right now I'm just kind of struggling with the fact that like it doesn't feel like my teeth. Like it feels fake and I don't like that. So anyways, I will get used to it. But I literally, all I ate yesterday was a very small amount of like pasta roni. Um, because it was hard for me to chew, and since I realized it was hard for me to chew, um, I had mashed potatoes for dinner. So, I'm pretty hungry. Um, I'm gonna get up and go eat something in a few, and I've been talking more than long enough, and my lashes are not turning out today, but that's okay. And bam, I'm ready. Did this cute little hairstyle today. Oopsies. Okay, so let's go take on the day. It's 2.26, so I was at the salon for a little bit, and then I came home, and I ate something, and I just woke up from a nap. I'm not gonna lie. I woke up from a nap, and I'm about to go back up to the salon and work for my mom from 3 to 7, so let's get it. <laughs> You get distracted so fast. Okay, I'm gonna talk to you folks for a minute because this one's getting distracted while I'm trying to write. Um, so, so I don't, I don't remember if I mentioned this or not. Yeah, I did mention it, so we're gonna go ahead and fast forward through this. But, okay, so a few things. Number one being, I've been shitty at filming. It's partially because I know it's already like a 25 minute video. But, um, basically I was, I went back up to the salon, was gonna work for a little bit, but then my mom was like, it's kind of pointless for me to have to come back up here for a spray tan later. I might as well just stay. And I was like, okay, I understand. And so I left. And by the way, like I was gonna take shift orders like all day today and none have popped up. Like at all. So, I'm a little shitty about that, but it's okay. Anyways, so, um, I showered and I did my laundry that has been sitting on my chair, you know, those clothes that, like, like sweatshirts and shit that you don't wash every time and you just kind of throw it there, yeah, so I finally put that shit away. Um, and I've been... I've been um, journaling a little bit and thinking, and I redid my calendar that I have on my wall. Oh, you guys can see it. Yeah, I redid that because I'm making some goals for myself um, that are not very practical, but I'm going to do it because I have a tour of the Veda School on April 20th, um, which means I have next week and then it's on the Tuesday after that. Um, and if I decide that I really want to go there, it, like, that's a very scary choice for me to make because I didn't plan on going away to college. I have, it's like the thing, it's like the, um, same idea as if you went to community college versus, like, uh, state college, you know what I mean? So, I, I'm nervous, <laughs> very nervous. Um, I planned on going to the school near me, but it really, and I'm not trying to bash it in any way, it really would be a lot of self-education. If I went there, they don't teach certain things, um, and it's certain things that I really want to specialize in. And so, with that being said, if I do decide that I want to go to this school instead, because it's very much like a time versus money ratio that I need to figure out. 
when I go visit it, if I, if I love it, if I really, really want to go there, um, between the 20th and the 30th, I have to make a thousand dollars and save it is my goal. Um, because to me, I have trouble saving money. And if I can prove to myself that I want it bad enough to make that money and to save it in 10 days, then I know I want to go. You know what I'm saying? So that's my goal to myself, um, is to do that. And sorry, look, all of a sudden it just like got dark. <laughs> but, um, this, so I'm kind of just writing about that in my journal because like to put that in perspective, if I went there, my classes would start at the end of August and I would be able to save about $7,000 before I go, um, as long as I, like, somewhat keep that up. Um, it, it would be a little more lenient after that, but, um, if I can make that, uh, then, like, the 7000 before I go, then that's, like, an emergency fund for, like, six months. And for, which is long enough for me to find a job out there and, um all this stuff and if I really really want to go there and I don't see it practical for me to move out there oh my gosh you're so good that's so good you don't even know what you just did right I think that's the first time this kitten has retracted its claws oh you're so good so anyways um then I can make the commute there it's about an hour and a half away um, which wouldn't be a god-awful drive, but, you know, driving three hours every single day but just for school, you know what I'm saying? But I'm just gonna, I'm gonna keep my mind open. I'm not gonna be super disappointed if I have to go to the one out here, but at the same time, um, I, it's just, it, there's a lot. There's a lot that goes through my head when I think about this. But, um, in conclusion, I'm about to go get some Chinese and uh we'll see what's up i did not realize i've been talking for five minutes i'm sorry i will see you guys in a few i think this is its first time drinking water oh my goodness it likes it i think it likes it i think i need to give it more food though update while well, i have you guys here i got me some chinese about to feed my kitten so ooh. Not me always running into walls. Also, it's like 74 in my house and it's like 57 outside. I'm about to open some windows, but it's raining. Anyways, um, now I don't know what I was going to say. Oh, I went to this new Chinese place that one of my friends recommended. And it was basically just run by this sweet old man. I'm trying to pour this one-handed. And he was just so kind. And I really appreciated it. That's all. Okay, babe, so I just kind of want to update you on what's up today. I know. So, basically, it's a boy. I thought it would be. Um, I haven't officially named him yet, but I'm thinking Prince because he's got paw prints on his belly and Prince, you know what I mean? So, like, it, it, it works. Anyways, um, he does have... No, don't go near mittens. Yeah. He has mites in his ears. Um, they didn't want to treat him for another two weeks because he's too young, but they said that, you know, if he if it gets really bad, let him know when they will. But he is a bit too young. Um, they said it's actually really common in kittens. Uh, so there's that. He's doing very well, though. He's growing properly. Everything looks very good. They gave him a little bit of dewormer just in case. Um, so that's what's up. Um, I need to check mittens to make sure she hasn't gotten mites. They haven't really been near each other, maybe a couple times, but not, like, cuddling and stuff. So, anyways, um, that's what's up with that. Um, I have all of his appointments scheduled to get him all taken care of, you cutie patootie. They were all like, he's so cute, he's so little, and I was like, yeah, it's a tax, your arm in the middle of the night. I sound like such a parent. Hey, why are you biting? Are you teething? Are you teasing, you little cutie? Anyway, sorry. <laughs> so I woke up at like 6.45 this morning and went and took two shipped orders so that I had money. You know what I mean? Because I thought I was going to be spending a lot on him. Turns out it was free. So that was amazing. I love them so much. Um, and I think it's because I've literally brought like four cats to them. So anyways, um, I did two orders. I'm tired as... And... Um, what happened after that? Oh, well, Comcast took, like, extra money out of my account, so I had to go to the bank and figure out a situation and stuff. I didn't, like, go to the bank. I just, like, th withdrew money from the bank. And, yeah. Anyways. Um, and then I came home for, like, five seconds, and then I went and 
uh, had to fill a prescription. I have to go back and pick it up though. And then um, went to the vet appointment and now I'm home and I'm just thinking about like future stuff, you know, just discussing things with myself. And um, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling really good and tired. <laughs> so that's, that's what's up. Um, I will update y'all in a little bit. Um, me and this little boy are going to figure out his name. Yes, we are. Mwah. He's so cute. I will talk to you all later. Kitten got poo-poo on his paw. Kitten got bath. Kitten isn't happy with me. Had to do what I had to do. Hello guys. Um, so I'm about to close out this vlog because I already know it's super long and I kind of want to edit it a little bit tonight, if possible. Um, it's about 9.30. Didn't end up doing shipped. No orders really came up until I started taking a nap and then a bunch came up so that's really fun. Um, didn't end up taking any. But I just wanted to update you guys. So, um... Today, we found out it's a little boy, um, and we literally spent like three hours, my mom and I, trying to find a name. Nothing was perfect, nothing works, and we decided to go with Levi, because eventually I was like, you know what, I kind of want like a God-given name, you know, like Elijah or, you know, like John. You really are a camera hog, huh? <laughs> So I was looking up, like, names that are in, like, the Bible or, like, names like that, you know? And, um, one of them was Levi, and I really liked it, and I feel like that's really cute for him. So, uh, and you want to play with the camera, huh? Okay. Enjoy this pure footage. You're so cute. So, we almost named him Mr. Because I know I'm going to call him Mr. a lot. But I was like, no, he deserves to have, like, that can be his nickname. He deserves to have an actual name. You mess with exposure and stuff. Um, so, we decided on Levi. So, meet Levi. Mwah. So, yes, that's the update on him. Um, I'm going to take the weekend because I'm going to be working a lot. So, I'm not going to film. Um, it's not going to be very interesting for you guys. Wow, what a playful kitten. <laughs> Um, so that's really what's going on. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit the red subscribe button and hit the like button so I know if you liked it or not. Um, all that good stuff. Thank you all so much. If you want to see more of this kitten, subscribe, I guess. I don't know. I'll see you all later. Peace.